Hey y'all, what is good? What is poppin'? It is your motherfucking girl Piper. Here with another motherfucking glow. Let me turn this one. Um so start us off. It is Friday. I'm working six to ten. Hopefully I can stay later than ten. So I'm doing this like this because I got Pacey's on and I can't show my titties on on YouTube. You wanna know why, y'all? You wanna know motherfucking why? Because all of y'all got me monetized, y'all. Your girl is monetized, y'all. Monetized. Not 100% monetized, only like partial monetized because um, I forgot how many views I ha how many watches I have, but I need 4,000 watch and I'm almost there. So I'm really about to be trying my motherfucking ass off and getting these videos out for y'all so you all can get monetized. So I just want to thank every single one of you guys for you guys' support. You guys are the ones that got me this motherfucking far. And I didn't expect for my shit to be booming like this, how it be booming. So I just want to say thank you to every single one of you guys because I love y'all. Like, y'all really be saying some like real life shit to me and nothing but kindness. Like, I be watching other vlogs. And they be having people comment some dumbass super shit. You know what I mean? And so rude too. So I'm very thankful that y'all don't do that. Especially after the last couple of videos that I that I posted about me, you know, saying if I were to get pregnant by that one dude that I would get an abortion. Neither one of you guys said no crazy ass shit. So thank you to y'all. But today is somebody's birthday. So hopefully I make some money today. If not, it is a motherfucking okay. Also, I got my moving date, y'all. Your girl moves into her motherfucking apartment on Tuesday. It is motherfucking Friday. Tuesday, y'all. Tuesday, y'all. I'm lit. Let me get the fuck out of here because I'm loud and I feel like they can hear me out there because if I can hear them, I know they can hear me. Somebody's also waiting for a VIP, so let me go out there and do that real quick. I know I just said a lot in a short amount of time and didn't really like <laughs> talk on it for real, for real. I'm sorry. I just had to let a lot of shit out. <laughs> I had to let a lot of shit out, but yeah. 75 for the first three hours of being here. Woohoo! So, this is how the night went. This how the night went. Beep, 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 beep. Look, I'm not showing my face because I have dried up, rubbed off eyeliner on my face because I did not go home last night. Um, but, goddamn, hold on. Got the girls all together! All right, y'all, so I'm at the trap. I got, I, I forgot already, it's either 89 or 99. I think it's 89. But I got $89 right now, and I've been here since six. It's about to be nine o'clock. Um, it's about to be nine o'clock. Sorry, my sister is texting me some wild shit, and it's distracting me right now, so I'm trying to remain focused. But yeah, y'all, um, I was supposed to get off at 10, but I might stay all night considering i move into my crib on tuesday and you're going to need to rack up on bread so i can get some shit from my apartment because i'm not taking anything i don't know if i already said this in my other videos but i'm not taking anything from my last apartment because i don't want no energy from my baby dad I'm not saying we were negative i just don't want nothing with him attached to it besides our son so yeah i'm gonna get everything brand new so for a minute i'll be sleeping on a air mattress until i get to bed so literally everything's gonna be brand new. So I need to stack my motherfucking bread. So today's Sunday. I'm moving on Tuesday. I'm off tomorrow. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Hopefully I can pick up a shift. They were talking about something I couldn't pick up a shift because I worked too many days this month. I don't know. No, but yeah, y'all. I need to change my outfit on because I had this on since six o'clock and I also have a drink out there waiting for me and I don't want it to get watery. So I'll see y'all in a bit. My mom and my sister were supposed to be coming up here, so we'll see if they come or not. Okay, so like, as you guys know, I told you guys I was moving to my apartment. I am in this hole. I am here, I am here, I am here, I am here. I'm supposed to be moving in today, but nothing is ready. They put new carpet in and they cleaned everything. They just have to re-clean everything because after they put the carpet in and painted, everything got pretty dusty. Everything got pretty dusty. So they're gonna have to come back in to clean everything. 
but I'm gonna show y'all real quick the empty apartment tour. Boom, so when you walk in, this is the living room. Boop, boom. Over here is the dining room. You see it, you see it. Living, kitchen, I almost said living room. Kitchen, everything is just dusty as fuck right now. The light, I don't like how dim the light is. But I'm loving the kitchen, I really am. Has a dishwasher, thank God. I was upset that there's not a lot of cabinet space, but there is a pantry. So the fact there's a pantry, I'm very much excited for. Because I've never had a pantry. Never, ever, 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 ever. So, like, everything is dirty. Everything is dirty as fuck. So we need to do all of this shit. We need to do all this shit. Yeah, we are drinking this shit. Yeah, they need a lot of cleaning. This shit all better be done tomorrow. Because I'm trying to be in my shit tomorrow. This is the hallway. Thermostat. I love this because I've always had to go to a laundry unit to wash my clothes. I have my own laundry little tiny room. Thank God. This is the closet I was gonna have my son's stuff in. All his clothes need to be hanging and I'll have his dresser stacked down here. And then my room is on this side. I love this big ass fucking window. And I have another window right here. So this is the room. I'm trying to figure out how I want it because I'm I'm going to get a day bed with a truffle underneath it. So then that way I could pull his bed out underneath. So we're not sleeping in the same bed, especially when I, you know, find me a boo. We're not all sleeping in the same bed. So I'm just debating if I wanted it right here. But if I have it right here, it would be pretty and have my TV over here. I don't know how I want it because, like, I want my pool to be in my room because in the dining room, I'm going to have his toys out there. So I might have my day bed right here and my TV, like, against here, my pool, like, in the middle or something. I don't really know. But I don't like the closets because the closets are kind of small. But can't be picky. And then the bathroom. Ew. Nice shower. Nice and deep. Nice mirror. Big as fuck. I love it. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. But they're waiting on me to fill out some paperwork, so let me hurry up. But like this dining room area, I wanted it to be Zay's area. I wanted to put like some dinosaur wallpaper all along this wall right here. Like all right here. Have his toy chest right here, his table and etc. I want all this I want this area to be his area. And then over here, I'll probably have I kinda want my TV on this side, but I might have it on this side. I don't know. I don't know, but this is my patio. Nice. I don't like my view, but <laughs> it'll do. And that is my, and that is my door. Mm, I'm so happy, y'all. I was so ready to move. I had the the fucking the fucking moving truck ready to go to my store just for them to tell me that they had to clean everything and it wasn't ready. So now a bitch has to wait even longer. Hopefully it's just a day and I don't have to wait OD. I'll be mad, but it's okay. Y'all, I'm out here moving. This is hot. It's hot. These are the apartments, though. Hey, y'all. So your girl is back and we are back. And I got little man's. You ready to go see our new house? And got my way. I am so excited, y'all. Um, I went to my mom's to get the rest of my things. Boom. And then she gave me some dishes and shit. Not dishes, but she gave me... Um, she gave me... 
a pot, a pan, a skillet. She gave me a skillet, a pot, and like some utensils or whatever. So I can cook dinner. I better unload my car real quick. And then I'm about to... Um, I better go unload my car real quick. And I better head to Walmart or whatever store is right by me. So I can go get food for... So I can go get food for dinner. I'm thinking about making gumbo. It just depends. Bro, look at my apartment. You see our home? It's our home, Poppy. They didn't even give me a code. So if I needed a code, I don't even have it. Okay, y'all. So your bro is unpacking. I left my bathroom little tray thing where I keep all my essentials on. I left it in my car. I don't feel like going back out there. So I just have everything right here for now. I still need to get a shower curtain. I forgot that today. I literally had to drive to two cities. I had to drive to my storage, which was two cities away. I had to drive over there for the storage, drive over two more cities to go to my apartment, and drive back to the storage, which is two more cities away, and then to come back. Like, it was a lot, it was a lot. So I went to go to the store to make some gumbo and my stupid ass, um, my stupid ass forgot to get plates or something for me to cut the chicken and sausage and stuff on. But I don't have nothing to cut it on, so I can't make gumbo no more, which I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow when I go to the store. So I ended up just making my son some breakfast for dinner. And then me, I'm just going to eat some noodles. I tried unpacking some of the clothes. I got somewhere, but when I look at it, I look like I got nowhere. And that's only because I'm only doing my son's clothes right now, not my own. So, yeah. So, I was just chilling on FaceTime with this one guy in there like two days ago. He's really cool. He's really cool. Is this light turn on? Maybe she's not charged. Is she charged? So, I was trying to turn on the light on my tripod. But it's dead. I need to put this on the charger too because he's supposed to be calling me back. Alright, so I tried pulling my pole up, but my stuff to put my pole up is also in my car too, so can't do that either. So I'm just trying to organize everything and make everything look decent because I'm trying to hurry up and smoke and lay down. You know? I'm trying to smoke and lay down. 